Latin America Credit Union. A Utah mother hopes to help parents who experience loss. She knows firsthand what they're going through after losing her own son a few years ago. So she's raising money to get a cuddle cot for a local hospital. We pay it forward to her tonight. Back in January 7th of 2015, we lost our son, Ryland Gerald Henry. Elizabeth Henry's son passed away after pregnancy complications. Ever since then, we've kind of tried to build everything back up. She received a lot of help and gifts from the hospital after her loss. This is very meaningful and just his little special bear that reminds us of him. So she wants to help parents who are going through the same thing. To give back the way that we were given to when we lost him. She plans to donate a cuddle cot to Alta View Hospital. Basically just kind of a, a bed that they can keep in the rooms with them, that they can keep the babies with them longer. The cuddle cot is pricey. <laughs> so Elizabeth has been making and selling all kinds of custom crafts to raise the money. Just basically anything we can to make any little bit of money. It's time consuming and she pays for the materials, but she calls this effort priceless. I would do anything to have a few more minutes with him. So me taking this time to do these crafts is me spending time with him. We want to help her with her goal. Well, thank you. We have $500 to help wow. you buy that kettle cut. Sterling Nielsen from so Mountain awesome. American Credit Union is paying it forward. I will. We'll do You're more definitely. You're taking a tragedy into turning it something, something really good for a lot of people. So thank you. So that means really the world. That. that means the world to me. Thank you so much. I really appreciate it. It's going to go a long way to her goal. Elizabeth sells the crafts on her Facebook page. She can pretty much make anything if you'd like to help out. We do have some information for you on our website, our website at KUTV.com. Click on features, then pay it forward. You can also nominate someone you know doing good in the